Hi, and welcome to this 10-minute seated abs routine. So this is a Pilates-based routine with a core focus, all done in a seated position. So starting sitting up tall in our chair, come a little bit forward, knees directly out from the hips, heels underneath those knees, starting with a cat cow. So we're gonna tuck our chin and round our back, try to gaze up at your navel, and then the opposite, Push your chest forward, chin up, shoulders down and back. And again, nice and slow, we tuck, drop the chin, round the back. Lift the chin, drop the shoulders, stick your hips back. Two more, round back. Lift the chin, lift the chest. Last one. And lift up. Come back to a neutral position. Hands on top of the thighs. I want you to think about making a stirring motion. So we're coming back to that cat cow. We come forward, chin up to the side. As we come back, we're dropping our chin and tucking those hips. So a big circle here with our torso. We're gonna do four times in each direction. Come back to center, and let's reverse. Make these as big as you can. Shoulders press down and back. Last time. Back to center. Big inhale, arms come up. Exhale out to the side, and then hands and back of the head. Elbows nice and wide. We twist to the side and center. Pull the belly button in. Exhale as we twist. Inhale, center. One more each side. And come back to center, really sit down. Reach the arms forward, rounding the back, scooping that pelvis, we lean halfway back, and then up and reach. So make sure you've got enough room to move here. We lean back, tuck, use that core, lift and reach. Exhale. Inhale, halfway back, round the back, and left. Good, so think about engaging that core, doing a little pelvic tuck, like a little crunch back, and lift, just two more like this. And back, and left. Release the arms, again, big inhale. Out to the side. Hands back behind the head again. Extend that right leg out to the side, and we're gonna take our left elbow to the knee and extend it out. Knee and extend. If you're not comfortable extending your leg, then just tap that foot straight down on the floor. Knee, extend. Let's go three, two, Open up that elbow. Come together one last time, then lower it straight down. Reach the arms up. Now we're taking that same side, right knee, crunch, and extend the leg forward, arms come up. Little crunch and lift. Crunch and lift. So round the spine. Straighten the spine, lift tall. For three, two, and last one. Bring it in, going directly to the other side, starting with the front 
reach and knee. Pull, extend, and pull, extend. Make this move as big as you can, slow and controlled. Exhale, inhale, reach. Three, two, pull in last time, release it down, fingertips slightly behind the head, extend the left leg out, right elbow to the left knee, and extend. And again, if you're not comfortable extending that leg out, simply drop the foot straight down in front. Really open up that chest here, opening up that elbow. Last two. And come straight down, release the arms down. All right, shake it out, and then coming to a wide stance here, toes going to the corners, opening up those knees to the side. Again, elbows out to the side, fingertips behind the head. We're gonna extend our left arm down, reach, and then come back up. Belly button pulled into that core. So we're using our core in the side of our waist, not our lower back. Four times other side, big reach, bring it back up. So you should be feeling this right here on the side of that waist. Let's alternate eight times. Belly button pulled in. Can you go a little bit further? One more each side. Release down and let's toe, heel, in. Crossing our arms, our fingertips are on the opposite shoulder. We sit up nice and tall, this time leaning halfway back with a straight back. We come back and then lift up again. We come back, maybe your shoulder blades touch the back of the chair. And then we use that core to pull ourselves back up. Good again, straight spine. Two more like this. And release the arms down. Hands on side of the chair, come to the edge of your chair and then swivel your feet, your knees over to the right. We're gonna take one knee up and over and the other leg matches it up and over. And then we go right and left. So I like to think of this as a little half circle or like a fan kick with a bent knee using those lower abdominals. Up and over, up and over. Last two. And let's come back to center. Go ahead and sit your bum to the edge of your chair and then lean all the way back. So we're in a little C curve, kind of a slouched position here. Hold on to the sides of your chair. And then just start marching alternating knees here. A little scoop in our belly. Of course, keeping that navel pulled in. We exhale as the knee comes up. Feel free to keep it here or a little challenge. We can go left, right, hold it up, left and right, up, up, down, 
down. Now let's start with the right. Right, left. Good job. All right, bonus if you feel like it, both at once. Up and down. Use that core. Just two more, you got it. This is a big challenge, I know. Oh, nice job. Big inhale, arms come up. Climb that rope, lift, lift, lift. Stretch out those abdominals. And release it down. Nice job, you've activated your core for today. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you next time.